Well, hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing a August flip through of my planner. I know I really don't do plan with me type videos anymore. I will link my playlist up above if you would like to watch. You know, what's been giving me a lot of planner peace recently is just kind of filling it in when I get home and making it really work for me. If y'all are interested, I am using an Erin Condon Condon? An Erin Condren binder system this year. I have the navy cover and I chose the hourly color filled version and I really like that you can um, you know take these pages out and stuff like that like it's super helpful you know when you're trying to decorate or um, you know when I'm I'm right-handed so if I'm trying to write something on here like I don't bump into this I can just pop this little sucker out so it's really actually helpful for me so anyway let's talk about this week so this week is july 29 through august 4 and this was a pretty all right week um did a bunch of stuff and my mom and i were kind of getting stuff ready for niagara falls which you'll actually see in this um like planner, I guess. You're not gonna actually see Niagara Falls in the video, I'm sorry. Um, if you guys wanna see the Niagara Falls video, I'll link it for you guys. So um, we chatted about it on Monday. Um, we already had this plan like last year. And then um, I got the hotel booked and everything. So I kind of like figured out a plan. And then, um, you know, we kind of just like went from there. Um, I've been having some problems recently, unfortunately, some health issues. So I have been um, working from home. It's like digestive stomach problems. So um, you'll probably guys will learn more about that in September. Um, because I have some more doctor's appointments and stuff scheduled um, that I need to take care of. So anyway, I've been working from home a lot recently because of that. Um, Cause you know, I just had to be close to a bathroom, which is gross, but it's part of life, you know? Also on the third, I went to Ryan's apartment with Doyle and we had a great time and Doyle now owns his apartment. So <laughs> anyway, so it was a good time. Oh, and then I also released my ticket information for my 20 year high school reunion, which is coming up um, this October. So it's coming up really darn fast. So anyway, that was this week. And then we get into the week of the 5th through the 11th. And this was an okay-ish week. Um, I actually, on Monday, had hail damage on my vehicle at work. So that was interesting. Uh, went to a girls night with my friends and we went and had, well, tacos. I don't know. I think I just had rice. I can't remember. Anyway. Um, and then the next day, um, I made my hail claim with my insurance company and doing all that good stuff. Uh, the next day I had a migraine. So I had, these are my little migraine people things <laughs> anyways so that was kind of a crummy day um the next day i had to work from home because you know my well shit stickers there <laughs> i worked on my packing list that evening and i wrapped up a gift for a friend and then this was a really bad day um it was a sick day my mom came over to help me with some things and tried to sleep couldn't do it. My brother actually came over later on that day because he had to pick up some mail. Um, but the nice thing about that day was my friend's daughter was born. Charlotte was born that day at 9.29, so it was very exciting. And then the next day I did some laundry. I made my collab list. The Actually, the Wild Fruit Planners sale is going on right now, but this video is going to go up probably way after this, but I was making kind of my list and then I took a nap because clearly I wasn't feeling good the day before and started to pack my bags. And then I went to the twins game for a little while. We didn't stay the whole time, but we went to the twins game for a little while. Um, and then I did some meal prep. So yeah, and then the next week, I am actually in Niagara Falls. I had to contact my doctor about my problems. So I need to talk to him about an allergy test, stomach issues, migraines, and my prescription refills. So we'll get into that in the next week. Um, this, I worked from home these two days because I just was not able 
to deal, if that makes sense. Then on Wednesday, um, I actually was in to the office that day, which is great. Ran to the post office, and then I went to Ryan's apartment to drop off little Doyle Dog because Doyle was hanging out with Ryan from A Man With The Plans for the weekend, so that was fun. My mom and I left on Thursday morning, bright and early, and drove to New York, um, but the we actually stayed in Ohio on Thursday, and then we basically after lunch we got to Niagara Falls. Um, our check-in was at like 2.30 or 3 or something and we got there like right at that time so it worked out great. So we actually went and saw like a little Niagara Falls movie which I totally recommend. Um, we had some Chinese food that night and then we went up on this like looking pier area. I don't know what that's called. It's probably totally wrong. I said that. Um, but we watched the uh, light show and fireworks which is really cool. And then the next day, it actually rained quite a bit in the morning, and then we went over to Canada. Um, we went to a really great Italian restaurant called Mamma Mia's, which was wonderful. It was a recommendation from one of you guys. And then, um, you know, did a bunch of other little adventures in Canada, and then came back, and then we went on May to the Mist. Um, I got super burnt. <laughs> and then um, for dinner, we went to Hard Rock. And then on Sunday morning, we started driving back to Minnesota. So we just drove, and I just put in like food stuff because it was just like that's all we did um and then we stopped in illinois for the evening and then our tolls <laughs> total from like the beginning to the end was 74 dollars and 40 cents we should have just flew there <laughs> anyway so now with this week which we're in this is today we drove for part of the day and then i picked up doyle kind of later on in the afternoon it was about three four somewhere in there so um was able to stop by ryan's apartment which was kind of on our way home anyways um and then i unpacked did a little bit Bit of laundry and that was kind of my Monday and then on Tuesday went to work which was great um, all that good stuff and then I went to Abra to get a hail estimate um, and all that good stuff and I had to email Acuity which is the insurance company that I have um, once I got the estimate and then the next day unfortunately I had to work from home again I did have an appointment with my doctor and we have a bunch of things that we are now going to be dealing with um, yeah, so then my mom and I actually went to Applebee's that evening, um, and then I had to go to Walgreens to pick up a prescription. Next day, I worked from home as well, and then I had to make a consultation appointment for a surgery I need to have. Um, and then I also, this was the first day of the Wild Collab sale, which is right here, and we're currently in it. There are a bunch of shops that I shopped at right away, and then there are a few today that I am going to shop as well because I just can't help myself. Plus, I'll be doing a haul for you guys too. Um, the next day, I had my Culligan service come into my home. Um, they just come into my home a couple of times a year and uh, maintain my unit and things like that. So they do that when I'm not home. Um, or sometimes I am home, but whatever. They know how to get in. <laughs> Went to lunch with some coworkers and then helped out my HR person with some fall store uh, apparel items. Ran to Target to get some groceries and such. And then I got sick that night again. So that was no bueno. Uh, the next day I actually got my acuity check from here, from my estimate, so figured that out. So I ran to the bank and did my deposit. I also went to Walgreens because I had another pickup. Um, and then uh, there was a planner meetup at the Maple Grove Library, which I went to. Um, and then I went to Olive Garden with Ryan from A Man With The Plans. And then today, this is this morning, I had to place an Amazon order. There was just a couple things I was missing. Um, I was supposed to be going to a brunch with the Minnesota Trio, which is Ryan from A Man With The Plans and Jody from Life's Organized Chaos. I will leave their um, channels down below for you guys if you want to check them out because you totally should. However, Jody's plans changed. She has been doing a ton of traveling for work and um, she had to leave a little bit earlier than expected. So we, we're gonna reschedule that. So it's been maybe sometime in September that we will get together. Um, I had to drop off things at the lab and you can see what that is. Um, part of the doctor thing. And then today I am filming. Oh, look at this, I can do this. Um, I already did my uh, Simply Gilded subscription box, my September budget I actually just filmed, and my August spreads. 
that's what I'm doing right now. So yay. So anyway, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing all of my spreads for the month of August in 2019. I know I'm not really doing the plan with me's anymore, but I just really enjoy coming home and just filling in stuff or things I know about or whatever. It's just like really helpful for me. And if you guys are interested, I will link up in the corner my, um, what's it called? My planner piece video. I really talked about kind of the groove and what I'm doing this year and how it's helping me quite a bit. So anyway, I will leave that up there for y'all. But anyway, I'm going to get to pub publishing, no, <laughs> taking this footage and putting it in my computer. And I'll probably be doing a little bit of editing this evening. I'm not sure when this video is going to go up, but it'll go up fairly soon for you guys, hopefully within the next week or two. And also I need to do a little bit more shopping today before the wild collab sale ends. So anyway, that's it for me. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. If you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, feel free to follow me on Instagram. The link is down below. I am typically on Instagram every day, but clearly I don't publish videos every day. So anyway, I'm going to jet. Thank you guys for hanging out and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah.